Question 6. I have learned about different types of technology through the process of constructing my opening sequence. Firstly, I used a still camera to take shots of my pictures with the animatic. This enabled me to put the animatic together on the iMac through the iMovie, which then became helpful through the process of creating my product. The still camera also produced clear and usable pictures for the animatic in progress. The still camera gave a fluid and good structure towards my animatic. To put my sequence together and create the scenes, I was able to use a video camera, Canon FS100. The use of the video camera gave the life into my sequence because it created my scenes and developed the shots needed. It brought the animatic to life with the use of actors in correct locations. It also enabled me to use camera angles, camera shots, and put them together for the completed scenes. Also, I used iMovie, which was mentioned earlier because it was the program that developed and produced my animatic, and also let me edit the process so it had a flow and gave me an understanding of the opening sequence I was about to create, it gave the animatic guidance into my idea. Also, I used Final Cut. The Final Cut program was most important for putting my camera shots and scenes together to create the running product of my opening sequence. It enabled me to edit the shots, place special effects such as black and white contrast, which gave the product meaning, and dark and lonely atmosphere. It also became the use of sound and music, diegetic and non-diegetic sounds. Next, for the use of titles, I used Live Type, it was to create the main title. I used Skyrunner for my creation. It let me be creative and de develop my own company supporting my film. I was able to place transitions and colourful contrasts with bold fonts. During the whole process, I used a program called Blogger. The blogging process was to build up towards the final product. It gained the information from the research, ideas and feedback. This became a support for the process where everything came together and I was able to look back on. It gave evidence and the process points in which things could be recorded for relevance and to be used for improvements in places as feedback was recorded. If ideas didn't flow, I was able to fall back on it and develop something knowing from the recorded research. It also gave a chronological order of my development and process of the final edit of my opening sequence. YouTube also became a big part in the process. It was used in a matter of ways through the, through the progression of my final piece. YouTube was used firstly to look at different opening sequences of our chosen genre which helped broaden my knowledge and let me analyse and evaluate them to get an understanding of techniques used in social realism. Also, YouTube was used to upload the animatics so we could watch them for feedback as well as put them on the blog for reference, which helped us to look on improvements. Lastly, we used YouTube to upload our final edit of our opening sequence so they could be watched and marked, which enabled us to know our grades and people's opinions. Also, then let us link it onto our blog so we could evaluate.